work inspection time. So have a little look around the C class and you can see it is a mega mega sweaty boy. On the passenger side of the car, lots and lots of wash marring. Some of this will be from where I've cleared it, but the owner's main concern was the swirling, which you can see is quite abundant. Side skirts swelled up, paintwork swelled up. Oh, heat is clicking off there. On the top of the tailgate, I did notice, see the buff trails? So we'll measure the paint in a minute, see if it's been painted or someone's just gone at it with a polisher. Still got whiz the number plates off. Onto the driver's side. Rear bumper's pretty gnarly for swells, but no buffer trail, so that makes me think the rear end hasn't had a full paint, which is good. Always nice. Lots of finger marks there under the lift flap. <whistles> Buffer trails down this side. So from when I inspected this five, six weeks ago, we noticed some of these. See the paint colours quite far off there as well. More of the same on the door. And I remember seeing up on the mirror housing, can you see the white residue? So it's been hit with a polisher. Some more into the wing as well. Investigate that further in a second. Back up on the bonnet. Mirror housing's a bit swirly. Yeah, this obsidian black has such a nice pearl and a flake to it. On the roof, there's some deeper marks here. See that? It looks like someone's rubbed at a bird bomb. Shouldn't be too bad to sort out. And finally, round to the bumper. It's had a few bits of touch up then and there's some chips. So I'll say it hasn't been painted, which is quite rare on a used car like this. But that's good for me. Some scratches down here at the end has had a little goat polish in it. But we'll try and take them out further. Okay, so the car's gonna have two stage machine polish followed by a five year ceramic coating. I'm gonna get everything masked up now. It's all clean, prepped, dried, mask up all the rubber seals and edges that might get damaged with the polisher or might damage the polishing pad. And then we'll get cracking. <laughs>
Okay, so at this point we are halfway through day three on the sea class. All the paintwork has had its heavy cutting stage. So the swells have been sort of leveled off. There's a few deeper scratches knocking around. There's one up here. But as you can see, the paint's a little bit hazy. So it's all been panel wiped, it's all clean. But the cutting stage is quite aggressive like this. And it leaves sort of a haze behind. So I'm gonna go back now, refine it, bring up the gloss and get it ready for the coating application. So after refining the bonnet, you can see it's a lot clearer, a lot sharper. Remember how it was before, the sort of a haze around the lights. So that's cleared up. So that will be continue around the car, we'll panel wipe it, and then we can coat it. do a super quick walk around if you can hear me over the super rain but the refining stage of polishing is complete so there's a lot more glass all that haze is gone it's going to get a final panel wipe again just to make sure there's no residues left for the coating but we are looking good up top on the boot lid do you remember this was all buffer trails and swirls. That was just shiny, glossy, concealed that metallic flake, which is very nice. That down the passenger side, it's looking good. So the car is gonna now have a dual layer ceramic cone, so it's got a 9H super hard durable base layer, and then a hydrophobic top layer on top. Surprisingly, so let's get that on.
So it's day four on the C-Class. Uh, all the coating's done, wheels protected, tyres are dressed, uh, number plates are back on. So all that's left now to do is drop it back down to the floor, do the glass, a quick once over on the interior, and then it's ready for collection. So that's the C-Class all finished up, it's had its major enhancement detail, so two stage machine polish, then a 5 year 9H ceramic coating on the paint, uh, windscreen and rear window had a glass ceiling applied, wheels waxed, quick runs over on the interior, engine bay clean, tidy, dressed up, all looking fresh. So taking a lot of swells out of this car, some deeper scratches and brought a lot of glass out of it and now it's protected. So thanks again for watching, subscribe if you're not already, maybe give it a little thumbs up, that's always nice, and I'll see you next time.